run a company that makes personalised gifts. Basically, people send us their photos online and we put them on posters, t-shirts, calendars, mouse mats, that kind of thing. All of our customers order online. If the internet didn't exist, I wouldn't have a business. The most important part of the company is our website because that's how everyone places their order. We'd lose a lot of customers if our website crashed. It's a very cheap business to run, but one thing I don't like about it is that I never talk to customers anymore. It's all just online order forms and emails. I'd like to talk to a real customer again, you know, face to face. Wesley I've owned this cafe for 12 years, and I'd say that the internet is essential for my business. There's an art college across the road and the students come in here all the time, you know, just to have a coffee and check their email or whatever. If we didn't have Wi-Fi, this place would be empty. They don't even need a password to log on. But it does mean people talk less than they used to. Sometimes I look round and nobody's talking to each other. They're all online in their own little worlds. If they turned off their computers, they might make some new friends. But it also means they stay longer and spend more money. So I can't complain, I suppose. Frank. I'm the sales manager for a sports equipment company. And like most people, I couldn't live without the internet or my laptop. I've got all my personal stuff on there and a lot of information about the company too. If I lost my laptop, I'd probably lose my job. One thing that's changed because of the internet is that a lot of my meetings are online nowadays. In some ways they're great because they save a lot of time, but of course this means I hardly ever travel for work anymore. I used to enjoy visiting other parts of the world and staying in nice hotels. If we didn't have so many online meetings, I could get out of the office more often.